Mégantic, c'est pas un accident. C'est une tragédie. Une tragédie prévisible, annoncée et qui aurait dû être évitée. This is only the tip of the iceberg. And change one, uh, one item and there's no derailment. Oscar-nominated Quebec director Philippe Falardeau takes aim at the rail industry in his docu-series Lac Mégantic, This is Not an Accident. Falardeau's first documentary film takes a closer look at the political and systemic failures that led to the derailment of a runaway train carrying 72 tank cars filled with oil on July 6, 2013, that caused an explosion that killed 47 people, displaced 2,000 residents, and spilled more than 7.7 million liters of crude oil. Un heure du matin, ça bouge dans ma maison. Comme un petit tremblement de terre. So it's like as if they were operating on the wing in a prayer, you know, with their eyes closed, saying, so far, so good, so far, so good, we're making money, so far, so good. Not only it was probably more dangerous today, but the people in Megantic hadn't really got any sort of justice. Les fiches de sécurité ont été falsifiées. C'est le transport d'une marchandise très dangereuse sur les rails brisés de MMA. Nearly 10 years later, the event still deeply affecting residents who feel the incident was preventable and measures have not been taken to ensure another tragedy like this one from happening again. Many months and many years before, when it comes to the safety uh, record of the company, um, the practice of leaving an unattended train on the main track on a slope without any derail protection with the engine running uh, and carrying crude oil, that was repetitious. That was not a just one one time thing. And it was it was the company's policy and it was approved by Transport Canada. Transport Canada n'a pas évalué correctement l'augmentation du transport de pétrole par rail. Of the people of Megantic who had to to see death in front of them, deal with it, deal with the thoughts of suicide, and still are. Um, so linked together, it, it creates a, a powerful uh, combination that I think will move people uh, and maybe move some people to, to act and to uh, uh, ask uh, questions. The series is screening Saturday at Hot Dogs Festival in Toronto and will premiere on Videotron's French language video on demand service, Vrai, on May 9th. Some people knew these are the same problems over and over again. Where is Transport Canada? In Montreal, Brittany Enriquez, City News.